Emergency response crews are continuing their efforts in Mayfield and surrounding areas. They're taking chainsaws and heavy equipment in and working to feed people on the ground. One group is also offering emotional support now. Grayson Passmore gives us a look at how Central Kentucky crews are helping after the storm. We topped the hill and we saw Mayfield for the first time. It was just an incredible sight, and uh, to see that and the the, uh, the amount of destruction was was you know very disheartening, and and you just stood there in awe at the power of, of that tornado that came through. So those are Ron Crow says Baptist disaster relief teams from all over the country are in Western Kentucky now. Team members are going in with chainsaws. Others are working on feeding people. As the physical recovery efforts continue, so do the emotional and spiritual ones. We give them a shoulder to cry on. Uh, we love them through the heartache and uh, listen to their stories. And that's what they need, and it helps with their healing. Emergency disaster services crews from Central Kentucky have started setting up base camps right outside of Mayfield. Seeing that uh, courthouse being destroyed, that beautiful uh, antique uh, building, uh, people understand this is going to be weeks, months, and even years to, to clean up and uh, try to restore that, that small town life there. Crow says while they try to answer the questions they can. But you can see people that are just, where do we go from here and what do we do and how do we get through this? He can confidently answer that we'll get through this like we've done all other disasters together. In Central Kentucky, Grayson Passmore, Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. Ron Crow wants to remind everyone that monetary donations are the best way to help the efforts in Western Kentucky right now.